Texas is looking to start 5-0 and for the first time since 2009. Now, DeMarcus Holland starting at the point guard position with Javon Felix dealing with a foot injury. Isaiah Taylor, Felix not going to play. Connor Lambert. Wait. Lambert, Connor. Lambert, Connor, Connor, Lambert. <laughs> a little later, Texas would be up by five. Holland's going to take it coast to coast. You liked his ball control movement. Absolutely. Came out of the shoot, pushing in transition, which is something this coaching staff is stressing from the beginning tonight. Scary moment here as Prince Ibe is going to come up with the block. How scared should Texas fans be with this without knowing something right now? Well, I think I think Prince will be fine, but you know, in the first five games to have three injuries is, is certainly from an injury perspective, not off to the right start for this Longhorn team. All right, the front court would step up though. Cameron Ridley and Miles Turner, they would take over inside Turner. Ooh, he was smooth. Unbelievable, This that's kind of been his signature move, that step back. That step back shot and really him and Cam both tonight came out established major dominance in the paint. Why not take that, right, Drew? Tell you what, if you can shoot it, why not do it? <laughs> the big boy can shoot it for sure. Well, the two big boys, 24 first half points. Rest of the team only 12. Second half, the rest of the team would pick up their game. Texas up 17, but once again, it's Turner and Ridley. How about a pass from Turner now? He's doing a little bit of everything, but certainly those guys are so skilled and they're just playing off each other. And you continue their hot play, then Turner just continue. He only missed, he was 11 for 12, only missed one shot, Drew. I'd keep shooting if I were him. Guess what? He did. 25 points, Boom. a career high. Miles Turner, career high high night for you. Where did that game come from? Um, to be honest, it was really just my teammates, man. They kept me uh, kept me up. I struggled a little bit in New York, but I was able to come out here. They were telling me to stay confident, take it one game at a time, and this is a great bounce back game for me. Talk to me about that team mentality. We saw you in practice today working on some extra shots, working with a guy like DeMarcus Holland. How does it feel to be welcomed into this group the way that you have? I mean, it feels amazing. You know, a lot of guys will come up here as a freshman and think they have to own the team, but I mean, I haven't had that mindset whatsoever. I knew from day one I'd be coming in here, uh, playing with a group of older guys. I mean, a lot of people ask me why I'm not starting. I mean, it just doesn't really phase me, you know. It's just a great group of guys, and we're going to have a great, uh, great year together. So even after a game tonight, you're not hyper-motivated to get that start? Um, you know, definitely motivated every day to get the starter position, but uh, I'm more willing to do whatever it takes to win. And uh, if you could just talk about UConn moving forward, what do you think this team needs to do? Uh, we definitely need to execute better down the stretch and uh, not get too high when we're doing well. All right, nice job tonight, Miles.